Hey guys, so this is your teacher Vivek Dadu this side. So in this video I shall be talking about my teaching style. My teaching style is primarily based around imparting the knowledge the right way. I am really passionate about it. So knowledge imparted the right way is really important because it's not something which is stressful. In fact, it's fun all the way. Learners can have real fun while learning if the knowledge is being imparted the right way. And even more important thing is that knowledge imparted the right way builds intelligence and not just knowledge. Now intelligence is something which is a far more superior attribute as compared to knowledge because as the saying goes who wants a fool who knows everything but understands nothing now let's do a small example to demonstrate what teaching right way is all about let's say we are trying to teach counting to a small kid we ask the kid to count his balloons what kid has to do is that he has to draw as many sticks as he counts for example if he counts one balloon he has to draw one stick if he counts two balloons he has to draw two sticks if he counts three balloons he has to draw three sticks and likewise he has to go on like this we need to get to a point where the kid himself is fed up of drawing the sticks and he asks that how long do i need to keep on drawing these sticks isn't there a better way to deal with this problem it is now that we introduce him to the real symbols we tell him that you don't need to draw as many sticks as long as you are ready to learn the symbols for example one is represented by this symbol two is represented by this symbol three is represented by this symbol and so on please take a note that i don't stop at 10 and tell him that it's represented by 1 and a 0 no not yet in fact I invent a new symbol for 10, new symbol for 11, new symbol for 12. The point is for us to keep on going till the point the kid says that how many symbols do I learn? For every time I get a new count, do I need to learn a new symbol? I can't learn so many symbols. This is impossible. Isn't there a better way to do it? It is now. That is the right time to introduce the numbers to him the way we know them that is after 9 the symbols start to be getting reused we can tell him that he doesn't need to learn a new symbol in fact 10 symbols starting from 0 to 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 are enough for him to represent any number as long as he is able to make an intelligent use of zero we can also tell him that this intelligent use of zero due to which we were able to use the 10 symbols to represent any number was given to the world by our own country india after this the kid might come back to you and ask that what if i don't want to learn 10 symbols why don't they just have seven symbols let's say from 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 and after that they start reusing the symbols make it 1 0 1 1 1 and so on then you can tell him that yes he is right we could have done away with lesser number of symbols but the world has settled for 10 symbols currently and that's why we call this number system the decimal number system yet another contribution by india to this wonderful world the real world fact is that we might come across different kinds of kids some of them are really fast learners others are not as fast but then the education imparted the right way helps all kinds of kids for example the impact the technique which i demonstrated for counting it has on kids is this that is they learn counting along with it a bit of history of evolution of numbers 
they tend to develop a fascination with numbers because they start seeing it as an art which has evolved over time and also they gain some respect for india's contribution to mathematics so this is your teacher signing off now do contact me if you are interested in learning things the right way thank you and goodbye